My name is Stephen Elliott, the uh, company is c and &E Gun Shows Incorporated, and we were founded in 1986, uh, along with a partner in Indiana, Tom Conley. Uh, now his son is our partner, Mark Conley. Uh, we started with one show in Salem, Virginia, and, have, and expanded that to 90 plus shows a year in 19 markets in six states. We're here in Harrisburg at the uh, c and &E Gun Show. My name is John Carson. CNC Survival Supply is our company. We're out of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Yeah, c and &E does a great job of advertising in a variety of ways to get the word out to the consumers. So they're aware of the show as well in advance and it, it helps to bring in a strong crowd which creates a good atmosphere for the entire event. When I first started in 1986, my goal was to draw large crowds to the shows. We spend a lot of time and a lot of money producing advertisements, placing advertisements, uh, to make sure that these guys have people that can buy their merchandise. We had a great crowd in here on Saturday. Uh, a lot of people turned out to support us. Pennsylvania is usually very kind to us up here. Our company's been around for 25 years, and I think we did our first CNE show about 21 or 22 years ago, so that's quite a while. Uh, if there's a problem or something like that, they they solve the problems for us. They've been excellent to work with over a long time. He is a phenomenal crowd. He promotes well. He advertises heavy. I think he probably puts on some of the best shows on the East Coast. Some of the vendors that come to the shows, we have firearms vendors, of course, um, and that's what we strive to bring to the shows. Is we want the public to see a large selection of firearms. We have gone to calling what we do uh, one-stop gun shop. Firearms, ammunition, hunting supplies, we have outdoor clothing, military surplus, and we have the beef jerky, occasional beef jerky guy. Knives are a big part of what we do. Uh, occasional coin dealers, occasional precious metal dealers. Yeah, lots of collectibles come to the shows. We do have some optics dealers, a couple of big ones. Steve and Annette are, are, have been very helpful with me in locating great booth space, keeping consistent space so all the customers know where to go every time they come in. Uh, very nice people, very easy to work with. Gun shows are hugely popular as the political environment changes. The crowds respond to the threat by coming to the gun shows and buying firearms and buying ammunition and buying all the stuff that goes along with firearms. This particular show here, um, since we've taken it over, the crowds have gone up to around seven, 8,000 per weekend, uh, which is a good solid crowd for an 800 table show. I work for MackeysBarbecue.com. Our sauces are all organic. Most of the sauces are gluten-free. So I've been doing the shows to give extra publicity, extra advertising, and bring in the extra income for, for the company itself. It basically sells itself. We had the Harrisburg, Pennsylvania C&E Gun Show. C&E is here with one of their many shows they have throughout the uh, Northeast and uh, they're doing get in free at the Harrisburg Gun Show. The NRA signs them in for uh, $30 instead of $35, and they get a $10 coupon to come into the show free. C&E supports the NRA with a lot of get in frees in most of their shows, if not all of them. They are very good in their business and they know how to do the business. The example is this particular Harrisburg show where we are standing right now. It used to be a dead show until a few months ago. Since they took over, they changed the entire scenario of this particular gun show. Now we see a lot of crowd walk through the gun show and we see a lot of other different vendors we can call. It's a real good gun show. I mean, he does a lot of advertising. You can see signs when you're coming into town of a c and &E gun show. Uh, radio, he does radio and TV and that helps promote the shows. It's not solely a man's show. They do have other items here that women would be interested in, such as my 37 millimeter grenade launcher rounds. I've been working with uh, Steve and Annette from c and &E and Show Masters for, oh, upwards of six to eight years. They're uh, really good people. We, we love them. I think very few vendors ever have anything bad to say about them. 
We've worked with a lot of uh, show promoters over a 27 year period and these are two of the honest, most trusting, hardworking people I've worked with. We've had a, a ton of people here. The place yesterday was just extremely crowded. Today was a good, very, Sunday was a good crowd too. Uh, and we sold quite a few pieces of body armor. It's a big happy family. Most people don't know that you can own machine guns and silencers. They think that they're not legal, they're illegal. But it's really not true. As long as the gun was registered and is on the registry, you pay a $200 tax stamp and the gun is yours. Now it's taken the ATF about six months to process that paperwork, so it's not something that happens overnight. Christmas time, they put stuff out for you. It's nice. This is Stephen Elliott. I'm president of CNE Gun Shows. We'd like to see you at our future shows.